Otto. Style though, yeah. he just rolled. I know. Yeah. He's a little cooler. Okay. Yeah. Justin, <laughs> this was quite a film for you. I mean, you play a 17-year-old. You're actually so old. You're actually 22. My word. Yeah. But you really needed this film. You were out of work, living in your car, homeless. All that true? If, if you hadn't gotten this part? Oh, I wouldn't say homeless, but yeah. I mean, I, I had a couple dollars left, I think, in my bank account. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Tom and Steven sure, you know, kind of scooped me up and saved my butt from going back to Canada. Could you imagine that you were going to go from that to this kind of a part, and this kind of a film? That's a dream. Yeah, I guess so. If you told me this four years ago, I'd be like, you know, Get out of town. <laughs> <laughs> Justin, just a, a small compliment. Your scenes are very intense with Tom, man. You know, Academy Award nominee and the whole nine yards. And you hold your own on the screen. And I just want you to Thank know you. that you do really, really yeah. good. Yeah. And they're very yeah. emotional. Yeah. 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 You know, I'm so fortunate. I got to, you know, I was working and learning from, you know, pretty much the best legends. Yes. Um, yeah. And I'm so grateful. Job, I mean, these guys are the most generous. Great job. Thank you, man. Great job. The most generous guys. Great, great job. Miranda, we all know you because I, I own the DVDs from the Lord of the Rings trilogy. Uh, so and when you got the uh, the call that you were, you know, up for the wife of Tom Cruise, I hear you didn't think you were going to get the part. No, I got this call from my manager that uh, Steven Spielberg wanted to talk to me about War of the Worlds, and uh, at the time I was pregnant, and I thought, well. That's it. I'm not going to get the part, you know. Uh, you know, this great opportunity comes along, and, and I won't be able to do it. But I, I spoke to Stephen on the phone, and uh, I hadn't told hardly anybody I was pregnant. I was keeping it a secret. I hadn't even told my dad. And so I'm <laughs> on the phone saying to Stephen, "Please, don't tell anybody. But I have to tell you, I'm pregnant. I don't know if you know you want to cast me." And he said. No, we'll change the part. We'll make the part pregnant. And uh, <laughs> just changed story, it. Just like yeah. that. Yeah. He didn't have to talk story. to anyone. He just changed it. So you could well, just eat and enjoy and relax <laughs> and be yeah. great. She was really pregnant. Uh, it was great. It was great for the what, story. What did you have, a boy or a girl? I had a girl. Oh, that yeah. Yeah. Her name is Darcy. What is it? Darcy. Oh, what Darcy. Ah. And you're married to uh, an Australian, Peter O'Brien? Yep. And you have said that Australian men have a, a sort of a sense of masculinity about them that a lot of American men have lost. Oh. Now, having worked with Tom, do you still agree with that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's her husband. It's her husband. I don't think anyone is denying Tom Cruise's sex appeal. <laughs> 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 Justin, you had to work a, a good deal with Tom, and you went to his house, yes? Yeah, I mean, this, this was what, literally like the like? fastest production that you guys yeah. have ever done, right? Oh, yeah. So Can you tell us what this house is like? We decided to make this movie, and that was it. Wow. Two oh. weeks later, we were shooting. Yeah. I mean, so we literally had two wow. weeks to kind of hang out, and I went to his it's house. It's fun. Yeah. Came and in when thing... we were doing, working on the, uh, you know, Stephen was working on the animatics. Yeah, yeah. Ha hanging out. Yeah. But the one thing I really loved about Tom's house is it. When I was there, he let his kids decorate their rooms however they wanted, like paint their walls. What color? <laughs> My son was camouflage. You know? <laughs> camouflage? Camouflage. Uh, you know, and Bella has, she just had a drawing and a painting on the ceiling. Sweet. So your son, if he doesn't want to see Daddy today, he can, he can, you know, just get lost in the camouflage. He, you know what? Unfortunately, <laughs> I've never had to experience that. You know, <laughs> you know Tara, I'm sorry. <laughs> hard to do the running and screaming from the aliens because everybody except Miranda you are acting opposite something's not there right yeah I yeah. have to tell you do you remember we were going through that Stephen is yeah. incredible at directing because there was no there were no aliens there or anything and it was just you know we just committed Tim, how to do you it. do that how do you run screaming you, you, you get yeah. we, were, we were yelling at each other before the takes okay. we were just saying ah yeah, I mean, everyone just was doing it everyone was doing it Seat screen, we go, whoa, whoa. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. Well, Justin, what would you think about to get yourself that freaked out? Well, I mean, I'm, I'm like, I'm such a rookie compared to these guys, so just having Steven Spielberg sitting there and going, more scared, Chapman, more scared. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm like, I'm freaked out. I'm there. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Well, you know, we are really so happy to have all of you on. It is a great cast, and it is it really is. I mean, we don't give movie reviews, but everybody who has seen it is so excited by it. You're all wonderful, and we thank you, each one of you, for coming on. This is wonderful. Thank you. to us and we're going to stop before we ask you to get down on that one day again okay so our thanks to tom cruise dakota fannings tim robbins justin chatwin miranda otto war of the worlds is in theaters now and we'll be right back